This is the BioPro 190 biodiesel processor, designed, manufactured, and sold by Springboard Biodiesel. This machine will make 50 gallons of ASTM grade biodiesel out of vegetable and or animal oils. It's fashioned from 304 stainless steel and industrial grade components, making it safe, robust, and CE certified. Best of all, it's fully automated, making it the easiest processor to use on the market. Like a washing machine, all you have to do is load it up and turn it on. Here is a quick demonstration. The first step is to take off the lid and add 50 gallons of vegetable oil into the main tank. We've uh, added 49 already, so I'm just going to top it off with the last gallon. The next step is to add lye to your second port, the methoxide port. You can add sodium hydroxide or potassium hydroxide. We're going to add 1,520 grams of sodium hydroxide. Then you want to secure the port, the cap, firmly. Next you're going to add four gallons of methanol to the methanol. And the next step is to add six gallons of methanol to this second port. Okay, we're almost there. To finish this off, we're going to turn the machine on, hit the start button, and add 190 milliliters of sulfuric acid. Eight hours has elapsed and we have finished the reaction stage and we're now going to drain off the glycerin. I've got a tube here attached to the ball valve. We have a nice clear line between the finished biodiesel on the top and the glycerin at the bottom. It's going to be collected in this little tank. Here we go. As you can see, the glycerin is quite thick and dark. We'll be able to tell the difference between the glycerin and the biodiesel right as we get to the end. Okay, there we go. Now that we've drained off all of the glycerin, we have 50 gallons of reacted biodiesel, and what remains is we just need to wash it. So what we're going to do is hook the unit up to a water source, then we are going to turn it back on, hit reset, and then hit wash, and finally we'll take off the main lid. Our water out will be collected in this barrel. Okay, we've hooked up our fuel pump. We're going to open up the ball valve, and then, this is the good part, we're going to fuel up the car. <laughs> 